Here's an adorable story about friendship. It's titled, As Warm As the Sun, and it's written and illustrated by Kate and Jim McMullen. As Warm as the Sun. Toby loved a morning sun puddle, a lap on a lazy afternoon, a fire on a fierce night. But in time, the sun faded, the lap disappeared, the fire fizzled out, and Toby felt cold and cranky. At night, Toby dreamed of running, sniffing, digging, searching for something as warm as the sun that would never fade or disappear or fizzle. But he could never find it. One chilly morning, Toby heard woof, and in came Pinky. Toby circled. He sniffed. He pulled himself up to show that he was the big dog. Pinky trotted over to Toby's sun puddle and made herself at home. That wasn't all. She muscled in on Toby's lap. She hogged his spot by the fire. Toby felt pushed out, left out. He barked, Woof, woof, go away. But Pinky stayed, stretching into those warm spots as if they'd been hers always. Hmm, maybe he was the one who should go away. Clump, clump, clump. Feeling alone and forgotten, Toby curled into a cold corner. Bump, bump, bump. Toby felt something warm against his rump. It warmed him all over. And Toby knew the something as warm as the sun was right there beside him and always would be. Pinky knew it too. <laughs> as warm as the sun. Such a sweet story about friendship. I don't know if you have a dog at home, but I know that dogs do like to snuggle up against things that are warm. Until next time, adios amigos. Goodbye.